Hey there guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Before we get started, if you're new to this channel and you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button down below so you'll be automatically entered into the guillots. And also, hit the notification bell button to get notified whenever I post another video. So, I have two items to open up here. But before you do, just letting you guys know, that I'm going to, me and my fiance are going to try our best to move out into our own place. We're going to try to save and that. So I'll give you updates along the journey and see how it goes. Because we want a house of our own. We want to move out. We want to be by ourselves in our own little house so we can start our life. Because as you know, we're engaged and we want to get married and have our own kids and that start our own life. I will take you along on the journey though. So just to give an update there. So I've got two packages to open up today. First one, we'll start with this one right here. I'm not going to show you the front of it because it's got my address on it. I don't want people knowing where I live. Now, do I? No, let's see what this first package is. I know what this is. You're wondering why I got bunches of bunnies. Well, that's because I have two builder bears. I got one at my fiance's house, and I got this one here. Her name's Alaya, and my boyfriend's got one too. He's got two as well. My other builder bear's name Shelby, and Carl's got one name. Um, Ellie. And Oscar. So those are the four builder bears that we got. And this builder bear is special to me. She's better than she's she's better than um Shelby because she's actually scented. She smells like bubble gum, so I brought these these are actually PJs for the builder bears. We share all of our clothes that we've ever brought for the builder bears. At the moment we've got four bits of Four bits of clothing, and we share them all. But uh, this one I brought for Kyle, for his builder bear, because he. I've got a couple couple on its way. I've got some that's on their way, and that. But he doesn't have pajamas. He, he he's only got one set of pajamas, just like me. And we want to get more clothes and pajamas for our builder bears. I've got some in the mail, so does he, and he's obviously showed up first. So I'll show you what pajamas Alaya, Oscar, Shelby, and Ellie's got. It comes with its. Oh, by the way, they come with their own coat hanger. So these these are the PJs. I'm going to show you what they look like on a layer. So yeah, these are the PJs. It comes with its own little coat hanger, so you can technically make like a little shelf for it. Who knows? And it's got their own tag. Obviously, this is brand new. It hasn't been touched or put on any builder bear, which is good. So I'll take the tag off her pajamas. Use my scissors to trim it. And it's got like a little velcro there so you can easily take it off. So this this is what the coat hanger looks like. Nice little coat hanger. And these are what the PJs look like without the coat hanger. They look like an actual onesie for a real life baby, to believe it or not. But this one has like a little hole at the back of it for its tail to go in. So I'll show you what I mean. So I want you to undress a layer and put her in the pajamas. If you're wondering about the holes, see, so stick the the builder bear's tail through it. So I'm going to undress a layer, which won't take me long at all. Okay, now she's got no clothes on. I'm going to put a layer in the pajamas. 
and then we'll see what this build of what a builder bear looks like with these pajamas on a layer. A layer is a demonstration, basically. If that makes any any sense. Oh, by the way, I'm not happy with my hair at the moment. I'm trying to regrow it back to health, and I'll take you on that journey as well. So stay tuned, because I'm not happy with it. I just want my old hair back, the healthy hair, before I started bleaching it and that. Yes, if you're wondering, I have bleached it and that. So, yeah, I'll take you on that journey too. So, a layer is... Now, in her PJs. I think. Yeah, she's in her, she's in these PJs. So this is what a layer looks like with PJs on. We were onesie. It's a one suit. So yeah, I think she actually looks quite cute. And I actually might leave her in these pajamas for the night. So she can wear these pajamas overnight. And then Kyle can get the pajamas in the morning. Because I did technically buy this these pajamas for his build a bit. But yeah, I just wanted to show you what the pajamas look like on a layer. So I don't look I'm not gonna change her in her clothes and all that now because I don't want the video to end up too long so I was just going to fold her clothes up and continue on opening up the next item because I really don't want this video being too long it will just, just bore you guys and it's already seven minutes in so yeah so the next item is this one right here okay I do remember ordering this item I think So this is the item here. It's I don't remember ordering it. It's a nice white crop top. I think I've ordered it in a large. I'm not really sure. But it is a nice white crop top with long sleeves, so it's like a jumper crop top. So yeah, I'm gonna put this in pause, put the jumper on, and I'm going to show you guys. So this is what the crop top looks like from the back and from the front. So I was hoping that the crop top would be about up to here on me. I don't think this is like a little bit too cropped. It's too revealing because like literally my original crop top, which is actually, I'm using it as my bra, my boob is literally right here. And you can see my other crop top underneath. Jumper crop tops aren't supposed to be this short at all. I don't think. Maybe if I was wearing this with an original bra, it might be okay in high waisted pants. Like, yeah, I think that would be okay. Give me two seconds while I put another bra on and then see what it looks like. Okay, so I'm back and I have paired the crop top with high waisted jeans so you can't really see my jeans but here they are they're actually high waisted jeans I think I need to get new ones because this one's a bit too short so with the crop top I just think even because I got my strapless crop top which I got off of eBay it's on a video haven't already please go watch it so I don't really like this crop top at all I think it's too revealing if I lift my arms up my bra literally shows from underneath and I'm not really an under boob person it shows too much of this area it doesn't go down the way I want it even look at the back but the back is just too revealing like if anything I'm going to go with I'm going to have to like try to wear this without a bra and if I wear this without a bra It 
if you wear this without a bra, if I lift my arms up, you'll definitely see my boobs. So this is definitely a no. I'm going to go and get chances to something more suitable for the intro and I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back to do the intro. So, as you see, from the last item, it is a no-go. I hate it. It was just too small. I liked it. I thought, I was hoping it did fit, but it was just too small. So the only thing I like is this jumpsuit, which is for my builder bear I actually took her off. I took this jumpsuit back off the builder bear and put her back in her normal clothes, off of camera. So, yeah, the only thing I like from that set is the jumpsuit. I was kind of ashamed because I really did like the jumper at first, but it didn't fit and I was actually really ashamed that it didn't fit because I was hoping it did fit because I really liked it when I ordered it. So yeah, I'm going to wrap up today's video because I don't want to be too, being too long. So that's it for today's video. If you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button down below so you automatically enter into the gillet. And also smash that notification bell button so you get notified whenever I post another video. Bye.